We are looking at an area of showers and storms out toward Mineral Wells and Graham, down toward Stephenville and Hamilton, picking up a few showers and storms. This is part of that larger, stronger cluster of storms moving out of uh, West Texas uh, here this morning. So this will likely a weaken a little bit more as it slowly works its way to the east, but maybe some brief heavy downpours, perhaps in some uh, areas there as these uh, showers and storms are moving very slowly. So they may begin to impact areas closer to Fort Worth as we head toward late morning on into the early afternoon. So maybe throw that umbrella in the back seat. You might need it. Just kind of plan accordingly if you have some outdoor plans for the afternoon. But you see that area of showers and thunderstorms not as strong as it was as it developed out across uh, far west Texas, far western parts of the uh, panhandle, diving to the east and southeast now. But we'll still see that disturbance creeping eastward as we go through the afternoon hours. So here's how things may unfold. Looking at our time cast as we head toward mid late afternoon, we still may see an area of showers and storms moving in around the afternoon rush for tomorrow that or today, I should say, and that will continue into this evening overnight tonight that begins to settle down and for tomorrow there will be a slight chance for some showers and storms around as we go through the day, but not a washout by any means on Saturday, but just a slight chance for a few showers and storms. We're also going to be watching the tropics as we get into the weekend, likely going to be dealing with a Alex moving toward the uh, Gulf Coast of Florida as we head into a Saturday as well as a tropical storm. So we're likely looking at our first named storms uh, of the uh, season here as it works its way off the uh, Yucatan Peninsula, getting back out into these uh, warm uh, waters of the uh, Gulf of Mexico. So that will likely strengthen to a tropical storm and impact areas across uh, southwest Florida, getting out into the Atlantic as we go through the uh, weekend. So we'll keep an eye on that. But here at home, here's our weekend forecast. We'll be around 90 tomorrow as we'll have still that slight chance for some showers and storms around. Now on Sunday, we start to heat up quite a bit as we'll be in the low mid 90s, I think on Sunday. And then beyond that, we're going to be looking at plenty of sunshine, hot and dry and very summer like uh, unseasonably warm as we get into the early part of next week. We'll be up around 98 to 99 next Monday and Tuesday. Temperatures probably not coming down much until we head to next weekend and we're going to keep it dry in that 10 day forecast for now.